What's going on YouTube? This is First Cars 21 and welcome back to a new video. Does this look familiar? Here we have every single hobby box that I've slowly started opening. We've got even more recent 0506 SP Authentic. It seems like I've been milking out this Topps Chrome for like 10 years plus this Bowman's Best. And we also got a few other packs here that I've recently gotten not that long ago. Eddie, I can hardly wait. I went ahead and pulled a pack from each box, plus pulled two from the tops because this actually comes with 36 packs. If I do one pack a month, uh, that's basically gonna take me like 20 years. And I wanna make sure that you take part of this. Let's go ahead and get right into this. You know what, we'll start off with the tops pack because we got two of those. We're most likely gonna save this 05, 06 SP Authentic for the end. We are looking for some nice, nice Jordan stuff out of that. We got 99, 2000 tops. Looking for randomly inserted superstar autographs. That'd be sweet. I got this hobby box from a local show. A guy who's got a lot of stuff, a lot of cool stuff. You all might know him. He does like those single card repacks. His name is Andy. Great guy and all. I typically kind of spend a lot of money with him. $450! When you got great stuff, you're probably going to get a lot of my money. AJ Green or AC Green. All right. Sean Camp. We'll go to the base a little quickly here. Eddie Jones. Byron Russell. Hersey Hawkins. These are a little bit stuck. Maybe we got something in the back. Oh, maybe we got something right there. Picture Perfect. I think is that Keith Van Horn? I can't remember. Let's just find out. Yep, Keith Van Horn. Picture Perfect inserts. A lot of these are gonna just be base. A lot of the packs are just gonna come with base cards. Base cards are severely underpriced right now. Don Reed, Charlie Ward, Glenn Robinson, Sean Bradley, and I think we got one more card before we got the checklist. Uh, Derek Harper. So we got some notable names, nothing big. Maybe the uh, other house pack has the autograph in it. Let's move to let's move to 97, 98 Bowman's best. You know we're looking for my guy. We're looking for rookies of uh, none other than Timmy D. If y'all didn't realize there, we got a pop one in the back. Got that back in a recent PSA submission. That actually helped me complete. Whoa, nice. Whoa! There you go. Sweet. Speaking of which, I think we might have a little, a little fuzz there. Very nice. If you didn't realize, all this stuff normally comes off. You just got a little blow on it, a little, put a little hot air on it, and it'll wipe off. Ooh, we might have something next here. What is this? We got a refractor? Ooh, this might be the pack of the box here. This thing is so cool. Let's do a little slow roll. Ah, never mind. We got Maurice Taylor. Refractor. Definitely would have preferred Timmy D. I don't even remember this guy at all. Maurice Taylor Refractor. Nice. It says it right there in the top left. Oh man, that's actually a pretty nice pack. Clyde the Glide. Carl Malone. You can see his name there. I think we got two cars left. Grant Hill. Nice. This is actually a pretty nice pack. Lots of stars in here. With the exception of that refractor. And Sharif Abdul Rahim. Nice. Definitely gotta take a second in. You take the card and leave my guy up. I think that's the first Bowman's best rookie I pulled of his. I'll clean that up later. Probably send that off to PSA, plus we also got a refractor out of that pack. I'm hoping we get more than one refractor out of this box. Nice. Let's go to this 2001-2002 FLIR collection. 
shoebox collection. We'll look for a game used memorabilia cards, one in 24 packs. Got a bunch of single packs from a vendor at a recent show. Give me a good deal on all the packs. Maybe we'll pull a nice memorabilia card out of this game used. If I can figure out how to open it up. Antonio Daniels. Mitch Richmond. Damon Sotomayor. Malik Rose. Antonio Davis. Damon Sotomayor. One wasn't enough, so they gave us two. Another one? Steve Francis, and nothing out of this pack. Jason Kidd. Yep, like I said, absolutely nothing out of that pack. Let's go to this Upper Deck Kobe Bryant pack. So this is actually a promo pack that they gave out at the Nationals some time ago. I don't remember what year this was. There's actually a 10-card set. I think it's a lot of it's uh, collect all 10 Kobe Bryant cards. But there's actually a, three cards in this pack. It's a very small set. I'd like to thank Andy. Mention his name again. He threw in a couple of these packs and some stuff when I bought some stuff from him some time ago. This is actually my first time opening up one of these packs. I actually got two of these. All right, so we got Kobe, of course. Another Kobe, and another Kobe, All right? So you get three Kobe cards, and ideally, you try to complete the set. Now, I think if you were to buy these separately, they were like, you know, eight to 10 bucks a piece, just for the Kobe's, right? So we got five, seven, and 10, 30% of the way there. It works every time. It's definitely a nice looking cards. That's definitely a nice shot there. A lot of mouth opening shots. I wonder if that's what their intent was for the Kobe's. I'll save those up later. Those will definitely go in the highlight stack. Let's move back to this Tops pack. Let's see if Tops can redeem itself after that first so so pack with Keith Van Horn. Another AC Green. This must be the same pack. Like I said, this box comes with 36 packs. We're probably guaranteed to get like two or three of the same cards out of it. Dale Ellis, Crumb Malone, Eric Williams, Nick Van Exel, Larry Johnson, Maurice Taylor, Dean Garrett. Looks like to just be another base pack. Hello. Dale Carey. And Kendall Gill. All right, so nothing out of that. Kendall Gill, he does do through the mail autographs. If you want to check him out, go to sportscardforum.net. Get all the autographs that, or get all the addresses that you possibly could want. Hopefully, do check the comments to let you know if y'all, if they're actually good at returning the TTMs. We got 99 2000 Series 1, finest. Looking for randomly inserted refractors. Little nice Kevin Garnett. Ooh, look at this old card. I think that's Maurice Taylor. What is this, the Maurice Taylor pack opening? Let's get these unstuck here. I'm gonna throw KG down there in a notable stack. Sharif Abdul Rahim. Matt Geiger. The Glove. That is Robert Taylor, or Trailer, Robert Trailer. Never even heard of him. And McCarty, Walter McCarty. Never even heard of him. Never heard of either one of these guys. So we got a typical three pack right there. Ninety-seven SPX actually only comes with one card, one premier die cut card. Ninety-seven, ninety-eight tops chrome, and this O five, O six. SP Authentic. You know, let's, let's see if we get some one card magic here. It says 97. I think this is 97, 98. So, of course, we are looking for my guy. 
And it's a die cut, so we could probably get an absolute nobody out of this pack. I've never opened up any of these packs before. And do take into account, chances of you getting something nice out of a bunch of random single packs is slim to probably not even worth it. But I like opening up packs for you all. You never know. All right, let's see here. Yep, it is a die cut. We got Antoine Walker. This is actually, I think, 96, 97 year. Because this is SPX. I don't think we can get Timmy in this year. Nice. With Jordan. We got Michael Jordan. That is just the regular. I do believe you can get these in gold parallels. And it would be like right here. It will look yellowish, but it's actually gold parallel. You say that's a partial Jordan. That's actually kind of cool. Nice. 97, 98 Tops Chrome. If I can get inside this pack. I got to tear this open. I think I might be halfway done with this Tops Chrome hobby box. Still haven't pulled the base Timmy yet. We're definitely due to pull, pull in from Tots Chrome. It was definitely nice that we started off with a nice second pack mojo there with Bowman's best, Chris Mullen. Tyus, Edney, got an insert. Ooh, let's go to the back here. Michael Smith and insert. Can we get my guy? Oh, I knew it was a destiny, but we got Grant Hill. Kind of a little hooked out there. Definitely comes straight out of the pack. It doesn't even matter if it's, the pack's been sealed or the card's been out for 30 years or not. But that's what happens with the Chrome, unfortunately, over many years. All right, so here's where we can possibly get some nice stuff. If you can find them. 0506 FP Authentic. Look for sign of the times cards, number to 100 or less. We are looking for some cool Jordan stuff. Let's see if we get anything out of this. We're going to get four cards, I believe, four base cards. Plus maybe something else. Or maybe just all base. We'll see. We did pull a Jordan and a LeBron the last time I opened up some packs. I think we, I don't know, maybe that's nothing. We got Yao Ming. Let's we'll throw him down there. Notable stack. Jalen Rose, Stefan Marbury, all right, we go to the back here, Drew Gooden, and last card is going to be, we're going to do this on three, see if we get some last pack, last card mojo, one, two, three, we got, nope, fooled myself, nothing, Jermaine O'Neal, I don't even know why that was backwards, <laughs> got he, <laughs> upper deck, you know, Panini definitely learned from upper deck, and how to fool us. Definitely got me there. That's a rarity. Didn't go a whole, whole lot of notable stuff, but we did get a lot of nice stuff in the highlight stack. We got a nice insert of Grant Hill. SPX of Antoine Walker. Got three Kobe's from the Kobe, Nas Kobe National Pack. Cool looking refractor. Do wish it was my guy. And we're going to go ahead and end off with my guy. One of the coolest things I have ever seen. First time pulling him out of Bowman's best. Very nice. Y'all take care. Have a good day. And thanks for watching. This thing is so cool.